below. <laughs> I wanted the bubbles them take off. I fucking too. love bubbles. You know what? If you did, you ever watch that movie, um, Zach and Mira make a porno? Yes. There was a girl, <laughs> and no dead ass. She, her name was Bubbles, <laughs> and she I took. No, 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 no. Um, in the movie, I don't notice I take my time to blow the bubbles. In the movie, what she did is she took the bubbles mm-hmm. and she put it by her pum pum. Well, like her pum pum blew it. But yeah. <laughs> like, you wanna blow some bubbles? No, I do not. But I wish I could make my pussy go like blow bubbles. I'm gonna tr- I'm gonna try, guys. I'm not gonna do it on camera. I was about to say, you're gonna do if, it now? If, if, <laughs> I tried. Make it a show. I tried. I think I would have to like. Fans that's something. something somebody would i don't for. know like are you guys do is that content you guys want to see me blowing bubbles with my fucking pussy like <laughs> call it the pub bubble diary somebody would pay for it bubbling <laughs> bubbling it's a different kind of bubbling it's gonna be a new sex term can she bubble yo can that girl bubble with bubbles dude i'm telling you pussy. it could be a new sex thing is can you bubble but not like bubble like in, in a club you know what i'm saying I'm, so crying like truly well i wouldn't try it first of all i can't can't take my eyes off of you and you i mean both of you all right three of you. the twins the triplets boobara 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 from season one. Oh man and two three four five all six seven and all of them. well we haven't gotten there yet but you know what I mean. <laughs> gonna be eventually for sure Baby girl, I got Zen motherfucking gold in the building, Hi ladies guys. and gentlemen. I'm back. Did you miss me? So if you <laughs> are a fan of Info Diaries, you know Zen. She's nasty as fuck, okay? First of all, <laughs> as I touch your breast, <laughs> I'm just showing you guys my nails. Perfectly fine. And her yes, nails. Right? She is an amazing, crazy dope erotic artist and other artists as well. Even. Yes, I do custom. Actually, well, I designed this shirt. It's my money mantra shirt. You can only get a special order. So if you want it. And yeah. I'm just loving how and your nails. nails. Yeah. <laughs> As I hold my tits. Them Thank you, huge. Tips by Kelly. Do you yeah. do, have you ever done any titty fucking at all? Plenty. I don't know why. <laughs> as soon as a man sees a woman's large breast, they're like, titty fuck. Oh, immediately. Titty fuck. Can you titty fuck you? It's I was like, like the first question it's not I get. good for, like, I don't, there is no pleasure in titty, titty fucking. If you are a woman and you like to get titty <laughs> fucked, I would love to have you on this show. Hi, you already have me on the show. You like, I like it? Me. Why? <laughs> like, let's get into this. I don't what? know. I think because I have extra sensitive Nibbles? breastuses. No, just breasts in general. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think they just kind of love everything. Yeah, okay. You know what? I think it's because I'm not... They're not as sensitive. Uh-huh. I don't know. Maybe I do like mean stuff, like um, as I punch my tit. No, oh my God, I don't, no, I'm not abusive to myself like that. No, no, no. <laughs> but I just, I don't know. Like anytime a guy wants it, I'm like, okay, if, if I really like you, like I've probably only done it with like two guys. Yeah, like, ex boyfriends. I'm like, come on, let me try. Come on, come on. I wish I, you could know, say it's only. Been and I was like, fine. Like one of those, and I'm like, I just lay here. I was like, all right. Like the I fuck? guess because I do. I do like extra, especially. What kind of positions mom. you got to be doing? Well, okay, for me, because like you know, I'm a plus size woman. Sometimes my arms hurt. It's fucking heavy. Like these are like these are pounds. huge. All you have to do is just They're slap like twenty two, pounds. Dude, okay. like, dude, these men have enough dick to go between all that. That's the thing. So if your dick long, you're probably gonna get your dick be big? at the same time. Is this big enough? Is the, it's probably as big as this fucking candle. Uh, that's big enough. Is it as big as this? As big as the. Fa- Ugh. Well, can I even do it right? Woo! Ah, ah. <laughs> all right. So, first of all, mm-hmm. this is a creation of Zens. Yes, it is. So, yeah. Coming soon? Yes, very yeah. soon. Okay. A couple weeks. Um, But yes, go on about your titty fucking. No, I just like, <laughs> I like, I, it's just, it brings pleasure to me okay. seeing somebody happy does it make you like get extra horny it does i have definitely had one or two orgasms from it titty uh, fucking titty fucking titty fu- yes what the fuck have you been here for like <laughs> they don't do anything i feel like i'm the only person that's actually like had that experience titty fucking but at the same time depending on the person yeah. i'd probably like suck their dick 
this at is, the same time. This is this. Mm. Just be done with it. Yeah. Okay. But I like sucking dick. Like that should. Well, there you go. Me, that gets me off. Okay. Like so, if it's big know. enough <laughs> like, and it can reach your mouth, yeah, and okay. cover the whole thing. Then like, anytime I've done it, it was just been I'm like this. Like this sucks. Like you know, when you go to a job and you hate it. Yes. You're like, oh, I'm just, I need the money. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not saying I was diddy fucking for money. No. It, right. it just felt like a job. I didn't like it. I understand. And I don't feel like sex should ever feel like a job. It should Unless not. it is. You. It's, and if it's your job, it's your job. And I hope you really love it. Yeah, for you know, sure. Let's, yeah. let's be honest. Definitely. Uh, so I want to get into our first set of questions. The funniest part's not even. I can't. All right. First one. Oh. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm not going to judge you if you say the yes. The joke is I fully like did the poll and answered and everything. And I'm sitting you, here terrified. Always. I, you guys, I love when you do respond to the polls. Please, you know, participate. Don't just fucking <laughs> ask. Yo, who said what? No. Like, no. <laughs> participate. And yeah, I would love to hear feedback, too. I do. I do enjoy it. Okay. Mm-hmm. But please participate. Yep. Uh, <laughs> have you ever sniffed? Someone else's panties. It can't be your own. We've all sniffed no. our own at some point. Guys, Shockingly enough. No. Men, you know, your draws, whatever, whatever you wear as underpants, okay? Your underpants, all right? <laughs> <laughs> your tiny whiteies. Oh, God. 22% said they've sniffed someone else's draws. All right. Why? Did you? Okay. Yo, so, yo, I guess that's a thing for Someone's people? kink, yo. Someone's kink. That's true. 78% no. I can't even like. I've never sniffed anyone else's draws. No. I'd be, look, I'd, I'm terrified. I don't know what I would get oh into. My God. Like, is it going to smell good? Is it smell bad? I don't know. Like, You get a week when they just don't drink water, like ever. <laughs> or they had like an asparagus fucking <gasps> buffet and eating beets. So like, you know, and drink oh. a lot of, like, who knows, man? Oh my gosh. The motherfucker got laxatives or some shit. I don't, I don't know. I, I, I don't. I don't. I don't ever want to know. I'm screaming. But I mean, if you, it's, I'm into some weird shit sometimes. So I mean, yeah. No kink shaming here. Exactly. We don't yuck anyone's yum, okay? Never. Have you ever sold your dirty panties? Yes. Yo, really? Oh, yeah. fuck. Okay. Completely by accident, to be honest with you. Like, it wasn't How? even like a... Like a full, like, sale, sale thing. Like, somebody went after me. I think your tits don't like the mic. What the frick is it? <laughs> is it good? Are we good? Is everything okay? Yeah. Okay, All right. Good. As long cool. as we're good. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> no, it's for real though. The sale of my panties. Basically, yeah. um, I left my. So draws. you fell upon a sale of your drawers. Kind of. Well, yeah. They ended up paying. For Cheers them, to you. Let's take a drink to that. If I because here, I'll get. Let me let me get, let me get that for you, baby. Literally, girl. my poor boo. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers to selling your drawers. Because, bitch, I'm about to find out. Only fans. That's where you can buy my drawers. <laughs> Private <laughs> message only. <laughs> but, um, yeah, you know, cheers to that. The sale of actually doing it was very oh, really? odd. It was like a... Okay, but it was... How was it by accident? So it was a guy I was fucking. Oh. And, like, okay. I... I left my drawers Fellas, at his take house. take notes. <laughs> I left my drawers at his house. Fuck. And, like, they were cute. So I was yeah. just like, I want the Mac. He's like, no. And I'm like, oh, well, give me money. So he gave me money. Ooh, how much did you tell them they were? And how much were they actually? I told him they were 50, they were 25. <laughs> Pocket that oh, 25, bitch, that's profit. Please. But, oh, yeah. Oh, man, I should have tried That's how that anyone. happened. You should do it. What? Easy Anyone money. That I've, you know how much times I've left them by accident? I was like, I don't know what the fuck Tell them are. that you need them. Oh, bitch, I don't even know sometimes. I'm just like... You know? Trust me, it was a surprise to me because I don't like, really. You pack up all your shit and you're like, yeah, yes. you, like you just, you know, and especially when you're about to have sex. Like, do you ever you're find your drawers? Hold on, have you ever found your underwear in the most fucked up spot? You're like, how did it get there? Yeah. Like, does a little like leprechaun come and be like, ha ha, like sex <laughs> leprechaun, and he comes and he's like, ha ha, and he takes your drawers and hides them for you? I mean, listen, listen. Where have I you found them in the dogs? I found them in the dogs. Like near the dog's shit, like the dog, not his shit, but like yeah. his cage, like his kennel. Oh, <laughs> I was like, where did the fuck in this room? So I think the dog took so my just underwear. Ended up <laughs> I was like, where the traveled fuck? With it. I, I just was like, I gave up. I'm like, I don't know where the fuck they are. And he's like, oh yo, I have a joke for you. I'm like, my dog had your underwear. Oh my like, god, what? Now he has it. <laughs> now he got it. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I just, it's one of those. Unless if they're really nice, then I'm not gonna do nothing where I can lose them. That's also true, right? Yeah, but like, me being dumb, I just kind of... You're like, fling them off, fling off your panties. Uh-huh. 
<laughs> I always forget something anyways. Mm, on purpose. Never on in purpose. Life. I'm just hella forgetful. Yeah, I know. I know. Super you ADHD. <laughs> Super. It happens. It mm-hmm. happens. We all lose shit. I'm always losing shit. Yeah. It happens. But um, yeah, 20, uh, 29%, sorry, 22% said yes, that they sold, they sniffed someone else's panties. Right. And 78% said no. Just right. wanted to get into that. When we're talking about dirty panties, because we totally forgot these fucking stats. Like, Jesus. <laughs> we just got so excited about selling draws, we forgot about the damn stats. So you guys want to know that's what's going on. For, um, have you ever sold your dirty panties? Yeah. 91% no. You guys are losing You're money. Missing out on You're money. washing away gold. Literally. Pum pum gold. <laughs> or body gold. Whatever you got down there, dude. You should put that on a panty. Dick gold. Pum pum gold. Pum pum, sell your panties. Oh my God, you should put that on panties. You should do it. No one steal that idea. I swear to God, I'll punch you. <coughs> in church. <court. laughs> oh my God. Moving on. No, but 9% have sold them. I want to talk to y'all. Yeah, Where do right? you sell them? If you sold your panties, let me know. How mm-hmm. much you'd be selling? Start, Where do you sell it? High. I would start high. Yeah. I'd always. be so extra. I'd be like, $300. Oh. It's way higher than I thought. 300 Way you're higher. Like, you're like, Dr. Eva, $1 million. Could you imagine somebody actually like, day, bought your panties my, for a million listen, dollars? Uh, my wedding stuff. If I ever get married, even if it's for like a day or something, I'm still going to sell that shit. Yeah, why not? It's not like a million dollars. That's actually dope. Yeah, man. And I lost it, my virginity would... in this. <laughs> see how funny that was because i wouldn't sell something like that i'm very sentimental that's so, cute yeah it's i would <laughs> i definitely would she's like fuck the wedding yeah no <laughs> sell every ounce of it everything okay all of no, it i get it i hear you <laughs> um if you haven't sold your panties would you sell your underwear you know or panties whatever you want 68 percent said yes of course like it makes sense. Yeah. If you want these nasty ass things, then go ahead. Take it. Save me laundry. Right. Make money. 20, sorry, 32% said no. I wonder why. Maybe it's a personal thing. Maybe. Maybe just the not people. It's people knowing, I guess, what they did. You know? Okay, like, I can understand. Like, yeah. If you, <laughs> yeah, I can understand. If you, but I guess you could choose what kind of panties. Like, you know? Yeah. If the person had their their rag whatever like you know that's what i mean what, what you did mm-hmm. what oh, you did for yeah. the day pardon me <gasps> oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> so like you know people are bashful of things and yeah some people don't even want to say they shit i'm like you're a human literally if you're not shitting does. bitch go to the doctor like <laughs> what yeah back are people that. that say they don't masturbate stop this bullshit i believe like one percent actually percent, doesn't yeah. super small percent not even one Maybe like maybe they're scared. Maybe it could be a religious thing too. Yeah, it does happen. It totally does. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Why wouldn't you? (laughs) Like, yeah, money, and it's something that you don't even need. Exactly. Technically, speaking of something you don't need but might sound fun, DP. If you know what I mean. (laughs) Okay, when have you seen this? I had to get, I was thinking, oh I was like, you know what? I'm not going to put an explanation beside it yep. or like a breakdown of it. Cause I was like, nah, everyone would know. And then I thought, I'm like, not everyone's a fucking freak dog. Like <laughs> not everyone's going to know. Somebody right? got to know. So I put it in. So DP is double penetration. Yep. <sighs> Self-explanatory. Mm-hmm. I mean, do you think that you could be doubly penetrated if it's not in your lower region? So if you have like a dick in your mouth or something in your mouth, it even could be a vagina. So I've done that already. If that's the case. Actually, no, wait, though. Because you part. not penetrate. You can't penetrate. A vagina can't penetrate a face. Well, no, it can't. Because like a face can't go into a vagina. No. Well. Like a whole head. Um, a head could come out. Mm, <laughs> I, okay, no, no I'm, <laughs> on this fucking planet has someone tried to put a human grown adult's head in their pussy. Are you serious? I swear to God. Shut the fuck up. Where? <laughs> okay, so. Where the fuck did you see I this? went down a rabbit hole on, what was what it? X website? and XX? X and XX. They have Has anyone else seen this shit? No. Please nope. don't leave me hanging because I know I'm not the only one. No. No. Nope. But I seen it and it was the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life. I refuse. Rebuke. Terrifying. How the fuck? That's with hair? It's a wide hole pussy. 
No, with no hair. He was bald. What is the girl like? Prime water pussy jar? Like, what the fuck? Nah, man. Not even those. You know when you go for a fucking exam? Yeah. That fucking trauma. Like, <laughs> that thing that busts open your pum pum. <laughs> Not even that can get a fucking head in there. Okay? Bitch, a fist is a, is like, okay, you got some fucking serious fucking muscles going on down mm-hmm. there, dude. Mm-hmm. But like, when you're going to give birth to a child, and I've never bared a child, okay? So this is just what I see on TV, what I hear from people that have mm-hmm. had kids, from what I learned. You open up, you contract, and it doesn't, yeah. like, it's something that you have to, like, your body prepares to do. Yeah. You can't just say, hey, I'm going to fucking take in a big-ass head. Did it get in? I don't. No, it did not. You need to look this up so right now. I will not look for that video ever again. Okay? If someone else has seen this, don't Somebody send it to me. please do not leave me. Because I'll block you. Because I know I'm not the only one. But if you've seen this, please tell her. Because I can't be alone. It's the most terrifying thing ever. It's scary. I'm fucking speechless. It's terrifying. Are you guys hearing this shit? A whole head in a grass, like a, an adult vagina? It's, 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 it's. <laughs> she just took it in. <laughs> She's like, hold on. I'm discombobulated. Yeah. Anyway, so the results <laughs> were 49% are down. For DP? Mm-hmm. Okay, so when... Have you gotten DP'd? If we're going to talk, like, dick, pussy, yes. Do, 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 do. No. Wait. Or if we're talking about, like, penetrated here, penetrated here, yeah. I mean, your lower... Re- oh, shit. Only the lower, lower region? Yeah, I mean, one in your ass, one in your fucking no. snatch. No. Do I want to? Yes. A toy could matter. I feel like... That's kind of DP. Well, okay, if it's a toy, then yes, for sure. Yeah. But like, like an actual in your butt. other, yeah. I need to try that shit. Honestly, it's, you'll. Love I've it. just had them in, and it feels great. <laughs> it feels amazing, <laughs> you guys. I'm telling you, when Root Kitty launches, just, just the gems. I'm so amped. The gems, honestly. The gems. The fucking gems. <laughs> Fabulous. <laughs> Fabulous with the jelly. Fabulous. Put it I'm in your screaming. butt. I'm always talking about butt shit. I'm going to get you guys all on to butt shit. I mean, I've been a little bit more. It's all about city girl now. shit. Now it's about to be butt slut shit soon. Just now. It's butt Love slut summer. Put it on a shirt. Butt slut summer 2022. It even right. Sounds good too. Oh my God. Hoo hoo. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, let me just fix my tits. Hold on. Like, you know what I mean. Boobera, you know those ones. That's why I can't wear them. Anyways. Are too big. Um... 49% were down for the DP and 51% no. That feels like it adds up. I'm think it's the people that are down for the 40, the 49 mm-hmm. are down for the butt slut shit and I'm down. Yeah. You guys are down. Listen. For sure. We're good. <laughs> we're good. 2022. <laughs> we're going to have a conference and everything. <laughs> okay, this oh one, it, I did not realize a lot of people did not know. I'm not going to say the question yet. Okay. I know you probably have done this shit, you nasty ass. I've done too much. I've done way too much <laughs> in my very young life. <laughs> Balls all in her face, bitch. Yes. All right, so tea bagging. Tea bagging. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's when you. You guys ever watch Soul Plane? They explain <laughs> it perfectly in it. So basically, you've got. I would do this with Zen, but this would be really hard with your tits. So <laughs> say this is a girl, okay? Say this girl, hello, hi, she's down here. And you're a dude. You take your balls and you're dipping it, all right, <laughs> in her mouth. <laughs> that is tea bagging. End of the bed, wherever you can get balls in yep. her mouth. Dipping it like a tea bag, like in and out, in and out, in and out. That's what you're doing. You guys didn't watch Soul Plane? Watch the movie. If you don't know what I'm talking about, maybe you're a little too young. Yeah, you. I was about to But say. that is what tea bagging, and a lot of people didn't know. Really? I'd be like, what's tea bagging? What's tea bag? And like even, you know, shout out to the lesbians. Ow. Um, <laughs> even I had one lady, she's like, you know what? I can I like pussy, but I could tea bag some pussy. I wouldn't mind and a pussy can be tea bagged in your face. You know, you just get up them, and down get and them up lips and down. in your, you know, just and especially it's a good little arm workout, all right. And I'm, everyone's gonna be rewind this part. Yeah. <laughs> tits tits alone. Tits alone. <laughs> <laughs> tits tits only, bitch. <laughs> Boobara part tits. two, part five, six, seven, eight. I don't know. Oh my god! You, I love you. Those jelly. I, they it's look great. Like jelly. <laughs> you ever just like? <sighs> yeah, I think every woman, big breasts, small breasts, play with their tits. Always. I constantly. I think play I with hold my tits. them for comfort. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever I'm working, it's ladies, just a hand you can teabag shirt. your titties in someone's mouth. Oh, okay. I know that's right. <laughs> right. Okay. I know that's right. Teabag them tits. 
That's what I'm gonna call this episode that teabag them tits. Because I don't like Oh my god. I don't like titty fucking, but I'll dip my tits in some boy's mouth. <laughs> some man. <laughs> Probably an older man. I like yes. old. You know what? Bitch, AJ ain't nothing but a number. As long as they won't go to die. Let's stay real rich. Then I'm gonna Anna Nicole that bitch. That makes sense. You know? Mm-hmm. But no, I like all you know, legal, please. Um <laughs> Oh my god! Why well, we both sit. sip on that same reason? Like at that same, we're like. Mm. Anyways, mm-hmm. for you <laughs> nasty assholes that like to teabag, fifty percent. This was a 50-50. You nasty ass. I mean, I love it. Sense. Um, pure balls in the face. It's and also if you I, you you got to do with a clean man, okay? One hundred percent. You should only be fucking a clean man, but bitch, like I know those times you may be a little too lit, and you're both lit, and you're like whatever. <laughs> right I don't care that you've been running around, dancing around, shaking your ass in the club. Put your dick in my face, like, but bitch, just brace yourself. And re- just put do your this. balls in my face. Yeah, like <laughs> teabagging is for some fresh out the shower. Yeah, you know, for or sure. you know he's clean, like he's just in yeah. the house, you know. Yeah. Unless you unless you're down with the funk. I'm not. I am not at all. I'll throw up on a dick. Not even the fun kind. Not even gagging. I just mean like. Th- yeah, legit throw up. I need to go. I don't even throw up, but I that. Know. Yeah. Do you like? Do you like throwing up? Like, do I like throwing up? Throwing like up. When you gag. Like some guys are really into that. Some women I love that. Hate it because like nothing. It just. Ugh, throwing up it hurts throw. my whole chest. I can't do it. But. <laughs> Yeah, no. I'm like your whole chest. My whole chest. This entire upper part just kills. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. No throwing up on my thing. (laughs) No, no. So, have you ever fucked someone out of spite? Majority of my sex life. (laughs) Tell me your talks without telling me you're toxic. I mean, this has been established. Really? Just don't like piss me off and I won't fuck your man. That's really it. Or your girl. Don't upset me. I will be fine. And it's hard to upset me. Like anybody that knows me knows it's And it's she's a really cancer. Hard. Yeah. But I have a Scorpio uh <laughs> Scorpio oh rising God. Gemini moon. So like For all the other witches. You know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> she like my dance moves. Gypsy life. I love that for you. All right. So anyways, for those that have fucked someone else out of spite, <laughs> 73%. Said yes? Yeah, dude. You guys are fucking yes, because toxianas. Sometimes it just needs to be done. Have I ever fucked anyone out of spite? Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, have I even been telling my side of these stories? <laughs> right? Like, I'm just like, well, I, I'm down for teabagging. Like I said, it's got to be clean. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm down to sell my draws. As you guys can tell, I'm promoting you guys to do it so out of luck with that. definitely do it. Only fans. <laughs> That's the only place I make sense. Oh, I think there's one called Sniffer. Sniffer. Oh, I've, heard, I've told the story before about oh, the panties. Yeah. That when I was on a plane, I think it was, I was definitely going to Miami or coming back. <laughs> and the woman, yeah, dude, where she was on the website and I was like putting my stuff in the overcase and I look over and I'm like, get it, bitch. Because I was so on So she's just plane. on her plane. I was, yeah, just, she up, she's like, I'm about to sell my drawers, bitch. Like, yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, and I was, fuck, I was, I was like, hey. That's amazing. Look at how much you're selling yours for. That's why I said 300. 300 for sure especially after a photo <laughs> shoot listen every photo when shoot i do for everything ruby kitty nympho diaries yeah. yo i will sell what the fuck it got down there if you guys are gonna buy it i'm so down even stuff i've just touched savannah make i'll just money. rub it on at one time just make all the money make all of the money <laughs> i'm here for it 100 percent. always <laughs> well anyways uh 73 said yes so yeah. you guys are toxic and 27 <laughs> said no good for you um, <laughs> I have. I fucked someone out of spite. Just once? A couple times. Okay. Not the same person. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes the same person. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yo. Kind of like a... Sometimes it just... Like a roll of dice. All right. Like it... it I don't know. To me... Sometimes and you this might be the super toxic part of me, but like it just feels <laughs> better. The super toxic? Oh my God. There's levels to my toxic... If I'm you done. really want right, to delve so into tell me, that. Bitch, what is it? So it just feels better. I don't know why, but to me, it just feels better. Like, ha, 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 fuck you. And that's it. It's kind of fun. It yeah. It's kind of fun. I think it's the best when you fuck someone out of spite and you're over them. And yeah. you know that you just are like, I know you're going to want this to last more, but no. Exactly. <laughs> um, so, yeah, no. 
So I, I'm sorry, guys. I'm part of Toxiana. Yeah. Toxiana. Um, Toxic twins. <laughs> <laughs> I have bubbles, okay? Toxic fucking twins. I'm be toxic. Oh my god! I bring joy. <laughs> <laughs> um, this one, I would. I had a joke. You know how many people message me or sent this to somebody else? What? Oh, All these bubbles everywhere. I'm terrified. <sighs> Are you fucking someone else's bae? Not currently. So Wait, much of I might you. <laughs> so many of you. So much. So many of you are fucking hilarious. Oh yeah! Oh my god! I'm fucking this guy's wife, girl, or this one's wife. And oh my this god! Mm -hmm. Y'all is toxic. That's uh, hilarious. And only 26 percent of you said yes. Some's not adding up, or maybe it's just the 26. They just wanted to, you know. Yeah. You guys, I really don't pay attention to who says yes or no. I really don't. I just look at the numbers. <laughs> I'm a numbers girl. I don't give a fuck what you guys do. Oh my god! Don't worry, I don't judge you. I only okay. judge my guests. I'm just kidding. Get it, get it, get well, it. the amount of times that I've been on here. Mm -hmm. oh and I know y'all with me with the shit. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so you're not currently fucking someone's bag. Not currently. I'm not yet because ah, they're still together. Like, Possibly soon. Money bag. <clears throat> oh, shit. I love him. Oh, baby. I'm down. Like, if the, him and Ari are down for a concubine. Uh -uh. Totally down. I would love a little Rolls Royce, yes. I love that. For and be about the parents' mortgage. And then... <laughs> A pay for me and pay for this, pay for student loan. That's what the Jamaican comes out. Yes, papi. Pay for me everything. Give me a nice little chain. Set me up nice. Set me up good. My man's like a villa. No, but he's just so fine. Mm, I love Southern hood niggas. Girl, get it. <sighs> but no, I'm not fucking someone man. else's bay right now. But 26% of you guys, man. Hi, guys. I see. <laughs> <laughs> so i want to get into a few things uh -huh. first of all what's up the black girl powder is shining right now i'm so happy so megan the stallion yes um what's her name naomi uh, am i say, i'm gonna am i saying this right i gotta say is it ox is it akana am i saying this right i gotta see it. let me show you you tell me am i saying this right she is gorgeous As asaka right let me see Naomi Osaka. I really hope Naomi I'm, Osaka, yeah. Yeah, I'm not killing her name, right? I'm not watching her name. No, you're not. Okay. No, you're not. Anyways, and Lena Bloom, cover of Sports Illustrated. All black yeah. women. And Lena Bloom is transgender. <gasps> really? So, like, this is huge. Huge, That's huge, amazing. Huge. Like, beautiful black women. Like, shout out to them. <laughs> I, uh, man, it just feels so great. I just feel like the past few years just seeing so much black women yeah. excel coming into their power and especially with sexuality you know Thank God. it's just Thank amazing God. like if i could tell the little girl of me when i was younger yeah. like so uncomfortable awkward yep. you know judged and cared yep. what everyone thought to who i am now mm -hmm. and like being in such a great community yeah. of like friends like you and mm. you know others that are out there and that even that i, I you know inspire to be yeah, or to you know, be like in some way, right? Um, in terms of like their journey, yes, it's amazing. It's Trust so me. amazing. So, I don't know, man. It's just I've had a it's a beautiful moment. thing. Yeah, it is a beautiful moment. thing. Like, it took me personally yeah. a really long time to even like sitting here right now, like with you on a live couch, on camera. live on camera, is like the scariest thing of my and life. Bubbles. <laughs> and a fan. Oh, yeah. I did that. Oh, I didn't do that. Way. You gotta flip it the other way. Whoa! The God is pussy fan. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Go on, baby. Love. It's all good. But, but um, yeah, like it's like dealing with body dysmorphia and like using sex to kind of cope with it because that's when I feel pretty. Like it's just like. It's a beautiful thing to grow from that. Yeah. And 100%. to be sitting here with somebody so amazing. Oh, thank you. Plus my friends, them that my gut, you know, like. It's just, it's beautiful because you know that they're not what the traditional mm -hmm. Sports Illustrated women. At all. That are the <laughs> Not cover. even close. You know what I mean? Yeah. So to see women that are like of different complexions. Yeah. Different backgrounds, different, like career paths, period. Like they're 
also different. Yeah. And so beautiful. Very and beautiful. fucking killing it. So <laughs> I just want to shout out to all my fellow black sisters out there. Okay. <laughs> I see you. We love that. Um, speaking of, you know, people in different mm. career paths, listen to this bullshit. Did you hear what happened going on during the Olympics? No. Olympics stay fucking. I try not on to follow shit. anything that happens. They have these people sleeping on cardboard bed because they don't want them fucking. <gasps> I'm like, and if you ever see the tweets below them, it was hilarious because people are like, uh, people can fuck on the floor. Literally on the, on the floor. Like, I feel like we're like 20 miles on fucking night crowd. Literally <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> like, a bed will not stop people ever. I, who fucks on a bed? Honestly. When's the last time you fucked on a bed? Like a week ago. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry, Realistically. I still haven't got week laid ago. guys, but listen, let me tell you something. <laughs> The borders are opening. Fully I vaccinated. I can't. People them are allowed, so you know, I'm going to be booked and busy. And no, I'm just kidding. No, it's not even that kind of party, but it's kind of that kind of party, if you know what I'm Girl, saying. Girl, get it. Girl, get it Man. all day. I'm not a pimp. I'm not a player. <laughs> Savannah, please. Savannah, I don't want to be a player no <laughs> I more. I can't. No, I don't even. You guys will never really know my story. I am so. Even my Good. friends. You guys, Good. You'll never really know. That I'm, little air I am, of mystery. I'm, I'm, I'm single. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, a, I'm, you know what I am? I am a Jamaican man single. Oh fucking Christ! <laughs> if you're Jamaican, everywhere. You know what? <laughs> families all over the island, all over Toronto, all over Canada. Oh That's my it. god! But no, for real though. These, That's where the, you're dead? the Olympic beds are they fucking curious? Like serious? These are like. These are the strongest people, like on. A hundred percent. You don't think make they can any stand sense. and hold her leg and get her pump right pump behind her head? Like, come on now, come fucking. They on. don't. They don't care. <laughs> They're just trying to act like they care. They don't care. My thing is, and someone else mentioned it in mm. the thread was that don't they want the athletes that gotta you know use their body mm-hmm. to be comfortable while they're sleeping. <laughs> like, no, nope, apparently not. And they're going to be sleep deprived. Like who the fuck sleep on cardboard boxes? Are they homeless? They're more worried about, you know, the natural functions of life <laughs> than the sport itself, which makes I feel no like sense. athletes like that yeah. are so used to have resisting sex yeah. in a normal setting. Yeah. They're around other athlete, athletes <laughs> that think exactly like them. So why mm-hmm. the fuck would they risk their shit? I mean, if you were a hoe and you're trying to, like, make someone lose, you'd be like, let me throw some pussy at you right quick. <laughs> and then he loses and you Maybe win. Maybe that's what happens. Maybe Take that's all what I'm energy. not. You know what? That's why I'm not an Olympian because I'd play dirty. I'd be like, uh-huh. Take all the energy right? and go about your business. Go fuck your coach and make him not even think too right. Actually, I do have a, I have a, I have a, I don't ever kiss and tell, guys. Ever. But this is a story. Oh, shite. Okay. So this is a long time ago. Back in my wild little young years. Screaming. This is my old... Chill years. <laughs> Did that, that sounded like a lie, right? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so Anyways, bad. I'm calm. I'm more collected. Hmm, <laughs> no anyways, pun intended. Um, I was at the time, like, you know, seeing, I'm not going to say, I've never seen names. I've seen this NBA player. Uh-huh. He was obviously older. You guys know I like, uh-huh. I like more. Anyways. I can't. So he had a game. Like, again, you're not really supposed to be fucking and doing certain things before a game or anything strenuous. <laughs> Let me tell you, I'm fucking putting out on that nigga, okay? I had to say his age. I didn't say his age, but why did I say he's older? Is that, like, you would think he would have no energy. Like, no. you know, it would be a bad thing. The team would have lost. Mm-mm. I'm sorry, Toronto. They won that motherfucking game. <laughs> Vitality. Pum, pum, pum. But, yeah, I remember watching, like, the game the next day I was like woohoo and Jackson I'm like you know I'm not supposed to be happy but <laughs> got a little pep in so your step I did that <laughs> right I did that. and he did really well so that's good I don't know I think different athletes she different pum, things pum, bring light. maybe that's it yeah pum, pum, maybe the it may, or maybe there's some people that have a dick that just like you know goes forever artist. yeah do you yeah. have ever have like really good sex that inspires you to do crazy art Remember, okay, so the Tell way me. that I do my art. Mm-hmm. You have to fuck first? The best way, like the best pieces come after I fucked. So should I try to fuck before the podcast recording all the time? Oh, yeah. I, I get, <laughs> get I need, your creative I need to flowing. get that. I need to figure that out. I'm, I'm no, not paying should. a hooker. You should. Is there even men hookers out here? Yes. There's men hookers? Yes. Straight no, I have hookers? not bought one, but yes. 
Really? They exist. Wow. If you're a man, straight hooker, please hit me up. I know a couple trying to get in the game, and it's the funniest Let shit me, I've ever yo, seen. Yo, I, I will, it's the I will help them out. I will manage. Yo. I had to switch my words real quick. Wow. Madam. Wow. <laughs> I will madam you into some pussy. I'm, I can't. <laughs> madam you into some pussy. Hello. <laughs> Hello. No, but for real, though. Yeah. Where would I find these men? <laughs> uh, like, is this something that you would have to know someone to know someone? No. Like, I've never you know the same that. channels that you'd look for a girl? Like, okay, I know of gigolos. And yeah. you, but I'd never That's really like basically know. the same thing. Like, So are them Backpage or like Leo? Yeah, Liz like Leo List. Okay. And then, does Backpage still exist? No, they got closed well, down. Well, shit like that, like. I'm pretty sure that's well, where I guess you I never looked for a dude, so I guess that makes sense. Or like sugar baby sites. Mm. Yeah. So pretend to be a sugar mama? Yeah. No. Don't I do would that. never. <laughs> I'd be like, you pay me, bitch. The <gasps> fuck? Give me all your money. What does this look like? Uh uh-uh. uh. Really? <laughs> I I'm 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 intrigued. If you are a male hooker, and we won't have to say you're a hooker, I'll just say you're a male compion. Our companion, <laughs> companion, bumper to the class. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dead. I'm gonna just walk around saying companion from Compion. now on. Companion, <laughs> interesting. Yeah, they exist. Go boy, you go boy. Boys do the same things that girls do. They just hide it. Mm. Like a lot, but I feel like men would want to brag to their boys. Like, yo, this bitch picked me. You'd be shocked. Paid me five bills to fuck. Well, maybe if it's like a one time thing. Men pay to fuck. Let's like be real. But that's true. But maybe if it's like a like they're in college or some shit, and like you know whatever, somebody pays them once or twice. Mm-hmm. But I feel like if it's like a job, some men wouldn't want to expose that because they might have like a corporate job on top of true, that. true. You know, very fair, very yeah. fair. So. But at the same time, boy, you fucking for money. Like, someone's <laughs> going to recognize you eventually. Exactly. At some point. You know? Have you ever watched that show Hollywood on Netflix? I started. Fabulous. Yo! Fabulous. Yo. And the guys were basically selling ass out of this fucking mechanic or some shit. They were making bank, though. Yeah! They were making like money, though. Ass for cash. That you one know? lady that always picked up that mm-hmm. one kid. Yo. And she was balling. Money Yo, for that boy days. made some money. And if that was in, like, modern day times. I feel like it is. It's just like you Do really you have can't any close friends it. that sell ass for money? Yeah. I guess sell ass. Like it's men or like men. just overall? Men. I only know of people that want mm. to get into it. Interesting. Yeah. Well, every guy wants to get paid to fuck. Like who? It's a dream <laughs> no, job. No, it's true. It's like true. let's be real. <laughs> Speaking of dream job. So if you're a lesbian who loves pussy, I guess a wax esthetician. Mm-hmm. So I seen something, and I'm not saying any lesbian that does waxing is like a pervert, mm-hmm. but there has been numerous situations mm-hmm. where, and I, this was a Twitter thread, and I was talking about this I with a like friend I of mine. Yes, yeah, okay, you definitely. And I was with a friend of mine, and she said the same shit. She's like, "No, no, no, my wax lady touched up my pom pom. She rubbed up on my pom pom." I'm like, "No, she was probably cleaning. No, she was fucking enjoying it." So, anyways. There's a lot of women that have experienced this. They're wax lady, Mm -hmm. okay? And this is, like, I've never been anywhere or heard of a male waxer. I've talked about it on the pod. Yeah. Where, and that guy looked like a fucking creep, dog. He was like, it's like, I can wax you. I'll make you feel comfortable. I'm like, why are you licking me? The scariest shit ever. We can take breaks. I'm like, do you know how hard, like, it hurts for a a pussy wax? And you want to I just want to know what he's saying taking breaks for. Like, what want, are we taking he breaks for? He wants to stick his dick in there just and get fucking, it done. Exactly. Like, you could do it after. Like, because <laughs> he was fine, bitch. I would go pff, get a wax point and then get my pussy really waxed right after. I can't breathe. Oh my God. But, anyways, all I'm saying was <laughs> there's bitches out there that are rubbing up on girls' pum pum mm-hmm. after they wax it. Mm-hmm. And I don't mean like rubbing like cooling stuff on it, Mm-mm. I mean rub up, rub up. And my girl told me that the girl rubbed her clit. Like, okay, you're not waxing nobody's clit. No. Your clit doesn't get hair on it. No. Yeah. She so like, she like, just. She just, uh, and she was like, in there. Oh. I was like, bitch, you should sue. The bitch got a happy ending. All right. And, but this is the thing. 
in the Twitter thread, yeah. a woman was saying that her boyfriend was mm. like, oh, hell no, you're going to the wax place and getting fucking done off. She's like, oh, yeah, every time I go to the wax place. Getting service. Place, yeah. <laughs> so is this a thing? I feel like. I don't know if I would be comfortable asking my wax lady, like, can you do the extra thing? No. Unless she oh was, my like, God. really hot. That'd See, be hot. I'm not going to lie. I, I mean, would be lit. I'd be like, this is what guys be doing. I get it. I get it. So out of please. Do you know what I mean? It's, Oh my god! Like, <laughs> if she's fucking hot, okay. If yeah. She's really hot, why the fuck? I mean, I'm already. I listen. I go to a wax appointment. Like I'm going down to get for dick. Pussy. Like it's like beyond clean. You know, someone's in there yeah. waxing shit. Like they get it right away. Yeah. So I'm, yeah. I'm like, this is the best time to get some. Are you done, <laughs> ladies? Fresh wax. You going to get dick? I don't care. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel Every like time. your vagina knows that it's freshly bald and super smooth and ready beautiful. for techie. She's like, get me some dick, bitch. Like, what are you doing? Have you realized that after your wax, you get like extra wet for some? Dude, reason? I am like, like in walk the chair. Fall. I'm like walking off the chair. I'm like, so what's going on? <laughs> when there is like, you know, slip sliding in your car. I'm just like, what's up? I just left a wax appointment. <laughs> what you got going on? Oh my god. <laughs> like, yeah, I've never had to deal For with that. For any exes that ever heard this or hear this, like, yeah, she's not lying. Yeah, literally. <laughs> call in now. Tell your story. <laughs> Yo, I should do a call in. You know what I do? Can you bleed? No, when I get my, no, I'll, I get my business line, I... <laughs> guys, I'll do call ins. Do like a live. Yeah, we'll do live. Like, I'll take calls. That would be the funniest shit. But, like, you gotta, you gotta fucking don't waste time because you're on the camera, dog. Yeah, like, don't just I'm, talk and shit And they're out gonna your hear ass. you. <laughs> They're gonna hear you. Exactly. So don't embarrass tuned. yourself. I'm not gonna tell you when this shit's gonna happen. It's just gonna be one of them shits. Like I'm gonna Beyonce everything. Just comes. Oh my god. Like I do everything else. Just hi, how you doing? <laughs> it's me. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. Oh, but for real though, have you ever had a wax lady though? Rubbed your snatcherina? No. Thankfully. Me, me and my either. wax lady are like friends, friends. So like I worked at a wax bar at one point, like and nobody got freaky freaky. I'm not gonna lie though, there was this one waxologist. <laughs> there was this one client that I'm like, mm, that wax doesn't take that long. Oh shit. Think about it, if I was a waxologist, I'd be fucking every time on my shift. The fuck, how they gonna know doing anything? I'm like, you just have to pay for that, honey. Like, oh my you God. gotta know we gotta do so many. <laughs> Running a service after you wax. I see no issues with that. But just make if sure it's you asked I'm like, for. buy the next two slots. At least he's paying. That's true. My lip. <laughs> lip gloss. <laughs> Annoying. But anyways, no, for real though, I think about it. Yeah. You would um, totally get your money's worth. <laughs> Such a perv. I can't. But baby girl, mm -hmm. I love you so much. I love you too. It's always a pleasure. <laughs> oh my God. I, I, I'm literally like leaning on your boobs. Literally. Everybody <laughs> leans on my boobs. You're so cute. Okay. Um, any last words? Um, get fucked. Oh, wow. Okay. But in the nicest way possible. Everyone, listen. Just get Last week, fucked. shout out to Scenario. We had over last week in the Pussy Palace. <laughs> she, en she ended, and I'm like, I want everyone to do this. I think every girl that comes on here, okay, men, you could do it too. Like, listen, <laughs> I just know you guys aren't ballsy enough. <laughs> Drop your fucking PayPal, your Cash App, your Vimo, your Zebo, your blah, 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 whatever you got. And tell them to send you some goddamn money. Tell me some too. If you guys don't know this, actually, I should probably promote it more. Um, at the bottom of every episode, there is a link. So if you want to send me some cash, I'm not saying you're going to see some ass. You're, you're going to see just it on Instagram. But and there's another way. But, you know, <laughs> anything to support the podcast and everything here. But for real, though, mm -hmm. drop some so people can send you some money. Buy some it, merchandise. Pal. Send some things. Because Sonara <laughs> put it out there. She's like, listen, if you want to be my cow, you know. My pay pigs and some bread. Yo, any like pay pigs <laughs> that need like me, just paypal.com slash Z G X L D. That is Z G X L D. Thank you. And make sure you guys check out Zen on Instagram. It's yeah. Zen.GLXD. There G -L -L is a, LD, right? There's two. But oh. Don't be, don't be, everything will be tagged. You guys will find Everything will be tagged, but it's Z dot G X L D creative. You ready to know, ladies and gentlemen, that is another one. X and O's house. We out.